in this video I will show you how to get started doing your own pixel art using Microsoft Excel so creating pixel art using Microsoft Excel is fun and a great lesson for students that are just learning Microsoft Excel okay to get started then go to google.com and do a search on pixel art okay let's go to google.com Google google.com okay and then let's search for a pixel art pixel art and just click images so we have here examples of pixel arts okay yeah pixel art with grid lines yeah that is why Microsoft Excel is a perfect uh, workbook for our pixel art drawing okay let's get started so I am here now in our Microsoft Excel application the first thing to do is to change the height and width of the size in the Microsoft Excel workbook okay we will change the width and height of our Microsoft Excel workbook so to do this we have to click this area to resize the height and width of our Microsoft Excel workbook okay just click this one to highlight all the columns and all the rows on Microsoft on our Microsoft Excel workbook okay so ilagay nyo lang ang cursor nyo in between the columns of two letters dito sa columns of two letters okay pansinin nyo uh, nag adjust siya so tingnan nyo muna uh, nag change yung inches and pixels nya so let's go to pixels 25 pixels 25 pixels ang biliin natin ayan okay so naka 25 pixels na ang ating what you call this one um, columns no ang columns natin is yung mga letters okay then adjust the pixels doon kay sa pixels mag base ilagay nyo sa 25 pixels ayan and well of course if you adjust the columns you also need to adjust the number rows okay number just put your cursor in between numbers in between two numbers so I'm going to put my numbers between 6 and 7 I mean my cursor between 6 and 7 then just choose uh, 25 pixels okay 25 pixels okay because you choose to adjust your column to 25 pixels then adjust nyo rin ang rows nyo within 25 pixels okay para perfect ang ating square dito kasi nga ang grid uh, um, pixels natin dapat perfect square okay okay let's start our beautiful drawing here in our Microsoft Excel workbook but if you don't have any idea on what to draw you may check you might check on uh, google.com okay you might go to google.com if you don't have any idea on what to draw google.com then well of course pixel art type pixel art okay images then just choose an image okay let's try this for an example okay let's choose an image uh, okay let me choose this one this one first ah uh, if you want to practice on how to design a pixel art just choose a pixel art with grid lines so that you have an easy access on how to follow those grid lines okay uh, let's try this one okay so as you can see you can uh, identify the grid lines okay just copy the image right click and copy and then you go to your Microsoft Excel application and then just right click and paste so here's our image so as you can see uh, yung medyo ano siya sakto lang ang kanyang grid line dito sa ginawa nating grid lines sa Microsoft Excel so make sure na sakto lang ang grid lines niya para hindi kayo mahirapan kung nagpa-practice pa lang kayo well of course kung magaling na kayo pwede na yung mga walang grid lines yung gayahin nyo ayan okay so check nyo sakto lang siya I think it this is good for me. Sakto lang siya. Ayan. Ayan. So, make sure na sakto siya kung nagpa-practice pa lang kayo. Pero kung magaling na kayo, pwede nang walang mga grid lines. Okay? Ayan. 
Pwede nyo siyang i-enlarge, ayan, kung hindi siya mag magkasya. Or you can just zoom in or zoom out your slider, zoom slider here. Ayan, para magkasya yung image na may grid lines. Okay, so ito sakto na ito ngayon. So, I guess we will start designing our pixel art drawing. Okay, so let's get started on our pixel art drawing. So, I'm going to put my cursor over here to start my uh, pixel art drawing dito dapat nakatapat siya dito so ayan tsaka if you want to draw a pixel art guys no make sure na dito isagad nyo lang dito sa maglagay lang kayo ng 3 spaces or 4 isagad nyo dito sa dulo para pag save nyo magkasyang kasya sa papel nyo okay so okay na ito dito sa akin so nagad ko na dito so approximately ito na siya so tama naman so how to put a color just you go, just go to home tab with the uh, font group and then fill color or paint bucket tool. Ayan. So, we have here the black color. So, I want you to choose black. Okay. Ayan. Click black. Ayan. Ayan. Home tab with the font color. Then, choose a cell to, to fill the cell with color. Ayan. Just click that one. Click that one. Okay. Or, you can highlight a cell, highlight a cell and then click the fill color ayan, you have to highlight the cell and click the fill color ayan ok, so highlight before you color the cells, you have to highlight the cells, when you click that one, it's highlighted, ok, or you can click and drag a cell, again you can click and drag a cell to highlight the cell and then put color on it ok, let's proceed or there's a, uh, another way, just copy the color of the highlighted cell, okay? Like for example, if we click this one and color that one with black, you can double click the format painter, okay? And then you have to click a cell, ayan, to color the cell, okay? Again, you have to click this one, you had to highlight a cell and put color on it. And then you have to double click Format Painter. And then click any cell you want to color with black. Yan. Okay. Yan. Again, double click the Format Painter. Yan. Uh, one, two, three. Okay. One, two, three. Okay. One, two. One. Okay. One, two. Okay. Again, you can choose to apply format painter if you want to color your pixel art let's do this again click a highlight highlight a cell by clicking that one then fill color and double click the format painter ayan and click any cell or click and drag click and drag ayan click and drag don't worry if you uh, mistakenly color a, uh, a certain cell you don't need to worry you can always delete that uh, color or remove that color okay just highlight the cell and then you go to no fill again if you want to delete a color or remove a color just highlight the cell if you want to remove this one just highlight this cell and just click no fill okay another technique on how to highlight a certain cell or fill a color in a certain cell aside from format painter you can click a certain cell to highlight and then I want you to press control on your keyboard. Press control. Ayan. And highlight a cell. Ayan. By clicking a square. You are highlighting a cell by, click, by clicking a square. But don't release the control button on your keyboard. Always press the control button on your keyboard as you click a certain square to highlight a square or a cell. Okay? One, two, three. I am pressing my control button on my keyboard. So, ayan. Control C, ayan. Or you can just click and drag, okay? Click, you can also use to click and drag by highlighting. And then, just click this one. Ayan. Again, if you want to highlight a square or a cell, just click this one. Just, just click a cell. Ayan. And if you want to uh, highlight multiple cells, just click, uh, press the control button on your keyboard. Ayan. Then press lang ang control button. And then 
I-highlight nyo, pwede kayo mag-drag. Ayan. Highlight. Click and drag lang kayo. Ayan. If you want to highlight again, just don't release the control button in your keyboard. Ayan. And then, well, of course, you have to press the fill color. Ayan. Then, let's change the color. If you want to change the color, just click this one. We have here the drop-down menu. Ayan. Let's, uh, we have here the red color. Then, I might choose this red color. Okay. Okay. Let's click and press or control on your keyboard okay click and drag to highlight several cells or squares ayan okay highlight nyo so don't release your control button on your keyboard ayan to highlight several cells ayan okay and we have the red color ayan well of course if you want to if you want to delete a certain color on a cell, just highlight that cell and then I want you to click no fill. But of course, if you want to change again the color, you can still uh, choose to uh, uh, apply some colors. Just click more colors and choose a another color. Okay, ayan, let's choose this one. I think this one is perfect. And click OK. Okay, so again, highlight click and drag you can also click and drag and press control on your keyboard click and drag click and drag okay then press control on your keyboard ayan ayan okay, i'll just finish this up okay i'll just finish this up Now we're done with our pixel art drawing. So this is uh, the Among Us picture. No, it's a beautiful drawing. So I guess we'll not be. I guess we will not be needing this drawing right here. So I'm going to just click this one and click delete on our keyboard, and delete and remove this one. So we have now our beautiful drawing, pixel art be beautiful drawing, on our Microsoft Excel workbook. Okay, you can choose to zoom in, and zoom out. Okay. Yeah. So this is our pixel art drawing and okay whatever you want to do just zoom in and zoom out okay now we're done okay now we're done on creating our beautiful pixel art now let's go to file you can uh, how to save this one or how to export this one just go to file okay just click file and you go to export and create PDF okay well of course let's choose desktop okay don't forget your file name I'll just write among us among us and then uh, save as PDF file okay save as type PDF file then nagay sa desktop bakit sa desktop kasi nga diba para we have the easier access on our document or our uh, MS Excel file okay again file name and then save as type PDF okay then let's publish okay now let's check our PDF file okay with our pixel art drawing using Microsoft Excel now this is now our pixel art drawing on a PDF file okay so we're done with our pixel art no so we're done with our pixel art drawing using Microsoft Excel and we save our pixel art drawing in a PDF file format so let's check on google.com of the other pixel art drawing so you can choose to create this one we have here the game over pixel art or the rose or the mushroom or no or kokoro sensei okay or a flag so we have all different kinds of pixel art here that you can draw so it's up to you to draw this one using uh, the amazing uh, features of Microsoft Excel okay so I hope you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe and follow this video thank you for viewing and watching so have a good day bye